Hey guys, it's Nathan Cashin, the host of Exploring Chiropractic, and I wanted to do a screencast here to show you a new tool that I just learned about that allows you to access research articles for free. You can get past the paywall, and it is called Unpaywall, and it's a browser plugin. I heard about it through TechCrunch. Um, there have been a few of these, so you might have heard of SciHub, and SciHub allows you to bypass the paywall uh, by some behind-the-scenes hacking it may in fact it probably is not legal um, there have been some issues the websites have been shut down they've had to pop up mirrors unpaywall is a little bit different unpaywall is potentially legal um, and as I show you this I do not condone piracy I pay for all my music most of my TV shows um, but I also am not a fan of paying thirty to forty dollars per paper when I download probably three or four research articles per day. So this one should be legal. What it does is it scours the web for free versions of the paper, whether that's on the author's website, ResearchGate, and different uh, resources like that. It only works in Chrome, and it is a browser plugin. So all you have to do is go to unpaywall.org and add this, uh, click this button to add the extension. Now, if you're in Safari, which I am, you won't have this option. It will tell you you have to open it in Chrome or Firefox. Just click Add the extension. It'll bring it up here. Click on Add to Chrome. Confirm that you want to add the extension. And the extension will be installed. And it will tell you that this means uh, this little green unlocked button means that the article is available for free. So let me show you an example of that. If I come to this website, this is a nature article, um, and I can come down, uh, click here for view full access options. Again, it takes me to a paywall. It says I have to subscribe for $200 a year or pay $32 for this one paper. Well, now with the extension installed, let me just refresh. It'll just take a moment, and over to the right of my screen, you'll now see this green unlock button. I can click on that. It'll take me to a PDF version of this article. And now I'm able to download it. So let's look at a few more examples. Say I'm uh, browsing PubMed, come across a paper that I want to read. I click the full text link, and it takes me to, of course, Elsevier one of the biggest publishers. Um, if I were to click here, I would know I would hit the paywall. Unfortunately for this example, this one is not available. I come over here to the button and it is gray and it is locked. This tells me that even unpaywall has not been able to find access to this paper. Another example is open access. So I'm just gonna go into my extension settings. And this is an option that you do have to enable on the extension. So if I click Options for Unpaywall, I can color code it for green and gold. And what this means is that any open access or open license paper, the button will be turned gold. I'm going to go to this awesome paper about chiropractic and stroke, systematic review by a bunch of neurologists and neurosurgeons. And if I click on the full text link, I already know that it's free, but on paywall now will confirm it to me if I come over here and I can see that that's a gold unlock button. So I know that this is a open access article. So that is unpaywall. I hope that's helpful. It's a very simple extension to use in your browser if you're running Chrome. Now usually my browser choice is Safari because I'm often on a Mac and I like to switch back and forth between my iPad and my iPhone. Sometimes I'll be browsing Facebook, a research article will pop up, I open it to Safari, I can easily send that to Safari on my Mac. It's just one extra step to copy that link into Chrome and to be able to access it through on paywall. It's free. Uh, it allows you to access research articles, hopefully, hopefully legally. Um, so give it a whirl. Hope you enjoyed this video.